five, four, three, two, one. Old school only is go. <laughs> G'day and welcome back to the channel. Today we're ripping this beast apart. So because I've got limited space in this shed, um, I've devised a cunning plan to basically pull the car apart as it goes out and then we'll end up just with the chassis at the back or in the front of the shed and uh, we'll do all the welding outside. Basically got to take it apart, flip it upside down, finish off all the welding, then we can dress it up, give it a coat of paint, paint all my bits and pieces and then start assembling the chassis. And, uh, then we can start working on the fun stuff. So now, on my chassis jig, I can uh, get under here and finish off everything I started at the top. Not a great deal to do really, bit of uh, dressing up to do in this spot here, board up the back of that, make sure it's all strong. And I need to clean up this abomination of a rear cross member. What I'm going to do, I'll probably get my um, plasma cutter and just tidy that up, make it look pretty, take a bit of weight out of it too. So let's fire up this welder. I don't have much gas left in my bottle, so let's just see how I go.
the night, yeah Make all the demons quiet, yeah We were built to thrive, yeah I think that we've all had enough What keeps you up at night, yeah Make all the demons quiet, yeah We were built to thrive, yeah Grab a bat, I don't know my rap, my blood boils over like Oh god, here goes, I lost all feeling from my head to my toes There's some shit that I can't let go, so just stay tuned for the rest of the show So have you ever felt betrayed? Could you tell you see things? Realize... Righto, I've pretty much welded everything I can on this side Including my cross member that's done Time to crack out the plasma cutter And we'll uh, make some shape out of this really cross member, make it pretty Those fellows that can freehand in a straight line. We'll whiz that up, make it look pretty. Got a few other things I've got to grind up. And then we've got to strip this chassis back as much as we can. Uh, I'm not taking all the rust off. I'll probably use Paw 15 or something like that over the chassis so it doesn't have to be perfect, but just get the scaly stuff and the dirt off and then we can start assembling it. Well, that's it for this video, I think. Um, I'm going to pack up and go inside. I got done what I wanted to do today, and uh, that was weld up the underneath. Cross member, cut that cross member out there, um, and obviously have it all stripped down. So, next episode, we'll probably get the grinder out and the, um, the abrasive pads, and we'll start to knock a little bit of rust off this thing. Anyway, that's it from me. Stay tuned, be good to your mates, like, subscribe, all that stuff, and I'll see you on the next one. Cheers.